Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I have another grocery haul for you. This is going to be a super quick grocery haul because I have got to get going to get the kids from school. I don't know where time went. I lost track of time today. So let's go ahead and dive in to this grocery haul. Go to Aldi today and I did go in and shop myself. It was so crowded. Maybe that's why I like to do grocery pickup. <laughs> Anyways, let's dive in. I got the girls some potato chips, um, or not really potato chips, different kinds of chips. Uh, I don't know how much these are at Walmart. They're $6, I think it was $6.79 at Aldi. So I'm not sure if I was getting a better deal or not, but I like to put these in Amelia's lunch sometimes just as a little extra surprise or whatever for her lunch and then I we are almost completely out of butter so I got some more butter last week's grocery haul I had ordered mild cheddar in the block cheese so I could shred it myself and they didn't have that um, they had tons of it this week so I went ahead and got four uh, packages of that so I'm going to shred some of this up and keep it in a container so that we can eat that and I got some raspberries for Amelia, some blueberries for both of the girls. And I had to go ahead and get another pack of bacon. I did the bacon for free, or how is it? Free bacon for life through Butcher Box, but I'm not ordering this month of December. I'm gonna order again in January, so I'm completely out of bacon. So I went ahead and got a pack. This is as close to butcher box as I could get. It's, um, there's no nitrates or anything and no antibiotics, no hormones, vegetarian diet. And that's pretty much how butcher box, butcher box is. So I thought this would be um, pretty good as close to it as I could get. And then I got a pack of ham for ham sliders this week. Actually, I think we're gonna do that tonight for dinner and some Swiss cheese and some asparagus, and some hash browns. My husband loves these. Amelia likes these as well, but she doesn't like tater tots. Go figure, have no idea. Um, they, I saw these new cheeses, well, new to me cheeses, and I thought I would try them. Crimson cranberry and ma uh, masquerade mango. So I thought that would be interesting, maybe like on a Ritz cracker or something, who knows. Um, also got a head of lettuce and some apples for the girls. My husband likes the Blue Moon beer, so I got this for him to try. I don't know if it's going to be similar or I don't know. have no idea, but I went ahead and picked it up for him to see if he would like it or not. And I got two things of milk for Amelia and some grapes and strawberries and then some more yogurt bites for the girls and some sweet and salty granola bars. They haven't had these in quite a while because I've been buying the other type of granola bars. And I got them some more syrup. And if y'all saw last week's video, grocery haul, I could not get my queso and they didn't have queso again this week. So I went ahead and got a big jar of salsa and the little jars, um, the Clancy cheese dip that they gave me last week. I'm going to go ahead and mix in the salsa and that cheese to get some queso. Hopefully it'll taste good. And I got some uh, sunflower seeds for Amelia and Jason. They both really like those. And some bread, Hawaiian sweet rolls. Those are going to be for the sliders this week or tonight. <laughs> I don't know why I keep saying this week. Um, I got some mild smoked snack sticks. These are like Slim Jims. They're really good. I got two things of baking soda. I like to put baking soda on Gyro's bed because it helps keep the dog smell out. I'll sprinkle this on and then I'll vacuum it. And it seems to help a lot. And it's only 50 cents a box at Aldi. So I went ahead and got two boxes of those. I don't know if I said it, some coffee filters, minced garlic, and I got this for Christmas dinner. Um, I have a roasting pan and everything, 
but I thought this would be nicer because it has the handles and you can lift that out of the pan and it hopefully will make things easier. Usually my father-in-law or my husband pulls it out of the oven or out of the pan and carves it. And then I also saw these cute little gift tags. You have that side and then this side is more kitty, kitty-ish. Got unicorns, mermaid, I love that. And little sparkles, glitter. And some tape. We always run out of tape when it comes Christmas time. I have two rolls already, but I went ahead and picked up another roll. <laughs> so I also have three other small things, but I can't show that because it has something to do with Christmas. So this is everything I got. And my total was $100 and some change. So not too bad. Um, like I said, this one is short and sweet because I have got to get going. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed it and I will see you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye. Bye.